Hey, what's up? In this video, I'm going to show you how to get your external synthesizers or sound modules into machine using a MIDI, uh, USB MIDI hub. I've got a one that is a 4x4 because I've got four synths. And the synths are connected to this via DIN connectors. And then I've got a USB coming out of the MIDI sport going into my computer. It's pretty easy to... Um, set up you just need to go to channel make sure you're not on group or master but on sound and make sure you're on output then go over to MIDI then select the destination I'll select port A because that's where my my top synth is it's a, a, an A station Novation A station and it's on channel 1 <laughs> Now I'm going to select the second synth. Now I'm going to go to the JV1080. Now I'm going to go over to the Proteus 2500. So on the studio controller, you want to go over to sound, then channel, and make sure you're on output. If you don't see MIDI, then use the cursors to select MIDI. And as I go through the um, through A to, A to D, I'm selecting all of the um, sound modules. Here is a beat I made earlier um, using uh, just the A station. Uh, this is one of the patches and I've already, um, what you can hear here is the uh, sample. It's a duplicate of this. I'm going to just open it up here. Just bring this down a little because it's a little too too loud. So if you can see, if I just pull this up, that is all the uh, MIDI information. And what I've done is I sampled that back into machine if I just go ahead and mute this if I just mute this part here and what you can hear now is the um, just a sample just turn that off turn that off turn that off so that's how you load external sound modules and hardware synthesizers and machine. In the next video, I'll show you how to just record the audio onto one pad. Look out for that one. And as usual, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one.